Information, the lifeblood of your business. It is pulsing through your company right now. Inbound traffic from customers, outbound to the cloud, from your branch offices to your international offices, through your data center and on your CEO's smartphone. And oh yeah, that one shadowy guy trying to hack his way in. F5 Gear sits at the center of this crucial information flow for tens of thousands of the world's top organizations, which is why security is so important to us, all of us. My name is Mark Kaplan. I'm the Director of Systems Engineers at F5, and security is my job. I work in business development at F5, and security is my job. Security is my job. My job. Security is everyone's job here at F5. We have a core security team drawn from all parts of development, experts with decades of experience in security. But we also get input from sales, marketing, even customers. We are always listening. We are deeply involved in security. All of us stay current on the latest threats and vulnerabilities. We read the news groups, attend the conferences like DEF CON and Black Hat just to keep our finger on the pulse of security issues. This stuff is really important to us. Security starts early in the process with threat modeling. Before writing a single line of code, we go through a process called threat modeling. We evaluate each new feature to see what vulnerabilities it might create. Our rule of thumb is that a vulnerability that takes one hour to fix at the design phase will take 10 hours to fix if we wait until the coding phase and 1,000 hours to fix after we ship. As you might expect, we try to catch these vulnerabilities during the design phase. Recently, we were adding a mail relay to our product. We were considering one open source mail server product, but we knew that for the past 10 years this particular product had averaged one major vulnerability per year. So we went with a different product. Even then, we listed the potential vulnerabilities, such as exposing passwords or the underlying network topology. The sum of all these vulnerabilities is called the threat surface. Our goal is to minimize this threat surface. In this case, it meant stripping out all unnecessary features from the mail server. Eventually, design ends and coding begins. That's where we apply regular code reviews. Once we start coding, we have regular reviews with the security team. It is surprisingly difficult because security goes against the grain for most developers, whose focus is on enabling things rather than preventing them. The most common mistake people find in the code review is using unsafe string functions. These can easily lead to a buffer overflow, but they're fairly easy to catch. Once the basic code is complete, security testing begins. First up, penetration testing. Our security staff deliberately tries to compromise the product. In essence, we get to play hacker. It's kind of fun. The truth is, we make pretty good hackers because we spend so much time thinking about vulnerabilities and threats. Once the penetration testing is complete, we begin fuzz testing. The concept is simple. Developers design a program to accept input, perhaps a network packet with a predefined structure. We assume the input will be correctly assembled, but what if it isn't? What if the packet length is too long, too short, or simply has the wrong data? That's where fuzz testing comes in. It systematically varies the input to a program to simulate thousands of variations and observes the result. Some malformed inputs might be handled well, but others might cause the system to crash, and still others might expose a serious vulnerability. Fuzz testing has revealed problems in our header parsing. These headers may have been too long or contained a malicious format that we didn't expect. Catching these errors before we ever ship to the field means that we are much more secure against denial of service or even code attack. F5 doesn't stop with internal testing. They also employ outside firms to perform black box testing. These companies have fresh eyes, which may uncover subtle vulnerabilities. Finally, the product is ready. But before we release it to the public, we use it in our own product environment just to make sure. Only then do we ship to our customers. To recap, in order to make certain our products are secure, we begin at the design stage with threat modeling, continue with regular code reviews, do internal penetration testing, perform rigorous fuzz testing, employ outside firms for black box testing, run the product in our own production environments. It is an expensive and time-consuming process, but security is an important goal for F5 and our customers. F5. Security is our job.